Welcome to Better Living with Patty. Hi, YouTubers. It's Patty uh, with Better Living. It's Tuesday. Um, I was going to start my series on um, thrift stores slash um, bargain stores today, um, <clears throat> but uh, I just didn't get up and get around to doing it, so we're going to do it Thursday. Um, I have been researching it. Uh, there's quite a few. Um, a lot of them are in um, churches, and um, a lot of them are in, like, what would you call it, community centers. So <clears throat> this series is going to last probably a good, um, doing it twice a week, probably a good um, two or three months because they're popping up all over the place. and. I was really surprised. We were in Bellevue yesterday, and uh, or fr Sunday, and I saw on this one road where the um, water is, a little pond is, I think it's called L Lillian, whatever, pond, there was at least three of them on that street. Uh, so two of them were in churches, and one was a, like, storefront type thing. So there's going to be quite a few... Um, Maybe I'll have to do two a day. Like if I go to Wildwood, I'll have to do the, the one by the, the Methodist Church and then the other one on Main Street um, because there's so many popping up that it's unbelievable how many, um, you know, it's not even Goodwill. It's actually just little mom and pa thrift stores. Um, I was really shocked about that. And some of these thrift stores have like food pantries attached to them which I was really surprised. Like the one in Wildwood on Fridays, <clears throat> Friday, the first and third Fridays of the month, they have a food pantry. While they're open, they have a food pantry going on. So, um, and then the Catholic Church up in um, Bellevue has a food pantry attached to theirs. And the um, St. Timothy's here in the Villages has a food pantry slash um, help you with different bills and stuff. So there's a lot of things popping up that I'm shocked at. Um, <clears throat> I was watching the news today and they said that more than half of the American people can't pay their electric or the utility bills. So they're trying to get um, state aid or federal government aid. And um, I was shocked at that because, <clears throat> you know, they said that it, the prices have gone out of this world. And um, I have to kind of agree with them because our electric bill uh, actually doubled uh, since the last time we paid it. It's, you know, so we were paying like 135 and now it's 270. Um, so it, it, it's a lot. I mean, so I was just surprised. And our gas prices are climbing again. We were used to 319 and now it's up to almost. Well, Sunday when we left for church, it was 325, and when we came back, it was 4, 459, so that was just on Sunday, so I can't imagine what it is now. Um, they're getting ready for the people, the snowbirds or seasonal people coming back down, I guess, and, and some people traveling because of Labor Day weekend, so I was just surprised at uh, how things have jacked up. Uh, so <clears throat> we went to one thrift store and I didn't tape it. I wish I would have, but it was packed. I mean, the people that there was, there had to be in this little house. It was a really small house. There had to be, uh, there had to be at least 25 people in that little house. Now this house was only, it, it's called a, like a salt box house, you know, but it didn't have an upstairs. It just had one, two, three. One, two, three, four rooms, and then the kitchen. So it was it was really quite small. And they had <clears throat> I, I'm gonna go back and um, film it, but one whole wall they had women's stuff on in the living room, and then they had and then one wall they had other women's stuff, and in the center they they were selling like um, not selling. They had tables and stuff like that, and then they had bedspreads and they had pillows and they had. Um, men's stuff in the back, and then they had, I didn't see shoes, 
maybe, I don't know, because that's a biggie with um, thrift stores, shoes. Um, they had belts, they had pocketbooks. Um, I'm trying to think of what else they had there. They had a lot of bedding stuff. They had sheets, they had, um, you know, stuff like that. They had some, some nice dress, uh, they weren't suits, they were like a jacket with dress pants and stuff like that. And they had a lot of ties. Um, so, and they had, they, they had, they, I mean, the, 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 there was three workers in there and they basically had to stay away. I mean, there was a lot of people in there, a lot. And they had a lot of stuff outside, um, you know, that like coffee makers, they had um, mixers, they had lights, they had lamps, they had, I mean, this, and people were just coming and they were just coming by gr car loads to get this stuff. And I was like, wow, I, you know, if you ever want to see the economy, go to a, go to a thrift store, go to, um, you know, like, there's a lot of secondhand furniture stores down here, which I was surprised too. Like, um, they're on consignments, I guess, and there's tons of them. There's one that's called Almost almost New, then there's another one across from that one. Um, that's run by the Catholic Church, then there's another one that's um, <clears throat> Count Your Blessings in Wildwood, and the, I mean, and then there's that one down in Wildwood that helps the, v, the vets. That, um, so I was like really shocked, even to the furniture, how much furniture they they re, they recycle, and stuff. So um, you know, and the furniture places have like lamps. Like I I've been to the one on Forty Four, so I can tell you what was in there. There's chairs, couches, lamps, um, uh, dishes, a lot of dishes. I mean, if you need dishes. You know, don't go buy them. Just go go to these places and get them for a couple dollars each. Because some of them are really nice. <clears throat> There's a lot of people. My mom was one of them. She would change out her dishes like like every season. And then she'd get rid of her dishes and get new ones. Um, some people do that. I don't I don't know why. I, I don't even know why mom used to do it. But she'd say, oh, I just got tired of that pattern or whatever. And she'd just get another... Um, set so I mean even to the glasses there's like tons and tons of glasses I mean yeah you can go to the Dollar Tree and get them for a dollar and a quarter I mean so if you don't see anything you like you can go to the Dollar Tree and get them for a dollar and a quarter the glasses and cups that I only you on when I'm on this uh, doing my talk um, you know plates and stuff but try going to thrift stores because they have a lot of um, uh, plates and stuff. What I don't see a lot of is pots and pans. So people must use pots and pans till they can't use them no more and they just throw them out. I don't I don't know why they do that. A lot of books. I mean, you you really don't have to buy books. I mean, the books are unbelievable. I think a lot of places paperbacks are a buck and the hardcovers are five dollars or whatever. A lot of books. A lot, a lot of books. I mean, wow. And then, um, you know, so, you know, there's a lot of things in there, and we're going to start taping it on Thursday. Like I said, I just didn't get up with an oof today and do it, so, um, you know, we'll start for Thursday, start a series. It's going to be a long series because I, I was amazed how many places there are, and I'm um, hopefully, if we miss any and you know of some that you want us to see, please just put it in the comments and we'll try to go. I'm going to go down there. I think I'm going to start in Wildwood, work my up, way up to 301 and around down that way, and then come back 441 to Leesburg. Um, so that's how I'm going to do it, I think, because there's a lot of, whew, there's, there's a lot. I mean, I was just amazed. It's just like the building here. Between, between thrift stores and Richard's theme on building, we are going to have content for at least... Uh, till Christmas. I mean, it's just out. It's unbelievable how much stuff is out there. So I, this is gonna be short and sweet. So without further ado, I'm gonna say so long. See you Thursday with um, going into a thrift store. Uh, show you what's in there. 
the furniture is really beautiful. I mean, they clean it up and it really looks beautiful. The only thing I've noticed with the furniture, they charge you a delivery fee, which before was $45. I, I'm going to have to price it out now with the price of gas, how much they charge. And um, lots of times they only come to your area one day a week. So that's another thing I'll have to find out for you. So, um, <coughs> okay, I'm back. Without further ado, I'm going to say um, so long. Uh, give this, if you like this video, give a thumbs up. Subscribe, ring the bell, tells you when we put up new content. And um, I'll see you Thursday. Be safe, stay healthy, and be informed. Bye.